Hello. I hope everyone has been practicing their combinations. If you recall, last time we added the hook to the jab cross and created our basic three count jab cross hook. Starting left foot forward for the first two punches, he points the mitts at me. My hands are up, jab straight down the middle as I take a little step outside his foot. Now I throw the cross, take a little step with the right foot. Now I throw the hook and I remain outside his rear leg, outside his right shoulder. And if I've done that correctly, jab, cross, hook, all the weight is now on my rear leg. The lead leg, in this case, the left foot is light. My right hand is up. I'm ready to throw another cross, but I'm trying to get behind him. So I need to take another step on this second cross. Both feet move, left foot moves first. So we've gone from your basic three count to your basic four count. Jab, cross, hook, cross. So again, jab, cross, hook, cross. What's the most difficult part of this? The footwork. What's the most difficult part of any sport? The footwork. And this represents the fourth and final principle. First principle, be heavy. Second principle, body versus limb. Third principle, no daylight. Number four, constant motion. I don't want to be a stationary target. I want to be moving the entire time. So again, slow, jab, cross, hook, cross. Move both feet on that second cross. Left foot moves first. A little faster, jab, cross, hook, cross. Again, on all four punches, he doesn't want to eat it, so he gives me a little back. One more time, jab, cross, hook, cross. Notice I'm rotating, not leaning. One last time, jab, cross, hook, cross. Practice that. Don't try to hit fast, don't try to hit hard. The speed will come as you get more fluid. Good luck. Let me know if you have any questions.